Hello, everybody! So, today I'm going to be discussing this leaked timeline, leaked, from 2017. Yes, the exact same year Kong Skull Island came out. And, the reason I'm breaking this down is because a particular movie. But... Let's get on with the video without more delay. So, on the website, they got most of the stuff wrong. They, they did a clickbait website with this about what, what the movies are about. Which, they got Kong Skull Island and Godzilla 2014, right? Godzilla 2014 is about the... Honolulu and the San Francisco fights between Godzilla and the Mutos, which they got that correct. Kong Skull Island's about Kong fighting the helicopters and then eventually fighting a huge skull crawler. They got that correct. And this is where they start getting stuff wrong. Godzilla King of the Monsters is about Godzilla and Kong facing off against other monsters for humanity. New footage of Kong wasn't even glimpsed in King of the Monsters person. Then again, this was 2017 and there was speculation everywhere. But it's about Godzilla. Shouldn't they be like Godzilla and Kong, King is, Kings of the Monsters? <laughs> Kings of the Monsters. Okay, I just... That was completely on accident, but it sounded like it fit. Godzilla and Kong, Kings of the Monsters. But it's only Godzilla, King of the Monsters, not Go Godzilla and Kong, Kings of the Monsters. And then Godzilla and... This is sort of right. Godzilla and Kong fight. This is what the website said about Godzilla vs. Kong. Godzilla and Kong fight. Godzilla wins the, the two battles they fought. First of all, yes, there are two battles in Godzilla vs. Kong. And nobody wins. Yeah, nobody wins in this movie. If you don't want to hear spoilers for Godzilla vs. Kong, skip ahead at least ten seconds. I'll give you, I'll give you two seconds to skip. One, two. Nobody wins because Mecha Godzilla, because Mecha Godzilla is in the movie. Anyway, dis destroy all monsters. Now, since this is speculation, this guy could be correct and not correct at the same time. Godzilla faces Godzilla and Kong face off once again to save humanity from dangerous monsters that want to infect the that want to infect the world with a virus. First of all, this is the same exact plot he gave for Godzilla King of the Monsters. And second of all, did he just predict COVID-19? People from 2017, did they just predict COVID-19? I think they may have. But <laughs> Anyway, let's get to discussing. So, yes. Anyway, um... Let's, I'm not going to discuss my version of this. I'm just going to discuss the poster that they showed off. So let's zoom in on it for you guys. So as the, as the obvious part, it's called Destroy All Monsters. But the monsters is red. And let's break down the image. Godzilla has his 2014 design. And for some reason it appears that Kong has his 2000 five design and um Godzilla appears to be roaring with his hands out but that obvious and Kong's roaring too with his hand out but that was obvious as well and but let's get to discussing where they are and what the and what they and what monsters they're fighting so let's start off by discussing the monsters Let's start off with the easy part. So let's start off with the one in the air. This one is obvious. It 
He's obviously a skull crawler because look at that face. Doesn't that look like a skull crawler to you guys? And or it could be Ghidorah. But keep in mind guys, the reason I changed in my Destroy All Monsters, my custom Destroy All Monsters, which will be releasing soon. I am sorry, guys. I am trying to upload another video, because two days ago uh, was my first anniversary of my Godzilla comic dub series. And so I'm trying to do a redux of the original one with the actual scenes from the movie. Which is like... Ghidorah being webbed to the building. Hey, Jira! You're gonna free them! Go away! Yeah, that one. <clears throat> Uh, anyway, I'm getting off topic, but, yeah, anyway, there's a skull, in my Destroy All Monsters series, um, I'm not, the reason I changed the vil villain from Des Ghidorah to Destroya <clears throat> is because, why the heck would we bring Ghidorah back? Basically, what Legendary would do bringing Ghidorah back is, hey, look! It's a new, it's a new, it's a new giant monster. Oh wait, it's got three heads. It's, it's a new monster that has the same, that has the same body structure as Ghidorah. And it's got new abilities, so it's not really Ghidorah. That's basically what Legendary is going to do if they bring Ghidorah back. But, so, that's probably a skull crawler. But anyway, um, what's the other monster? This one is pretty tricky. When I first saw the image, I thought it was Anguirus. It does look like Anguirus. You see the horns up on what appears to be horns, but no. That's actually hair, it looks like. <laughs> Don't judge me. I think it's actually smoke. But it looks like hair. And he's got the same arms as Anguirus. And, but what throws me off is because, look at the head. It's got a straight head, which Anguirus does, but there's a secondary mouth. Well, there's a mouth that's hanging down. That's what throws me off about this. What the heck? And then I, I assumed it was Baragon, because look, that flat thing on his head could be his ears, and that is, his head is bending down. But shouldn't he be staring at the monsters, not just... Homing the other way. And then I thought it might be Destroya, but then I realized he doesn't have any wings. But it does, could be, it could be Destroya because he has his pincher like claws. But yeah. Anyway. Uh, and then I came to the conclusion that it was actually Knife Head from Pacific Rim. Now, Knife Head is one of the Pacific Rim kaiju that is pretty underrated for me. Um, yes, I do like the kaiju from Pacific Rim. I have legitimately no problem with the kaiju crossing over into the MonsterVerse. I, I, I'm fine with the kaiju crossing over into the MonsterVerse, just not the Jaegers. The Jaegers would be too much for the MonsterVerse, and it wouldn't... And personally, for me, the if they bring in the Jaegers, the the monsters will completely implode on itself. Now I'm fine with Godzilla crossing over into their series, but not Pacific Rim crossing over into the monsters. So, yes, Godzilla can cross over to Pacific Rim anytime he wants, but the Jaegers, no. The Kaiju can cross over, but not the Jaegers. Sorry, all you people who want a Destroy All Monsters with Jaegers in it. Um, you can decide whatever you want. I just, personally, I don't want Jaegers in the Monsterverse. I'm, I, as I said, I am 100% fine with the, cro with, with the crossover of the Kaiju. But not the Jaegers. As I said. Anyway, I'm getting off topic. So yeah, that looks like Knife Head. Because its head does kind of look like a knife. But it's mouth. It could be not. It actually looks a lot like Knife Head. So now let's get on to where they're battling. It appears that they're battling somewhere in the ocean. 
Though it doesn't look like that, the waves would have to be huge. And I actually did a Photoshop last night, and I did it in the ocean. But that just didn't look right. And I did it in other places, but it didn't look right in any of them. And then I finally found a good place that really looked like it. The Grand Canyon. So, maybe they're battling at the Grand Canyon. Who knows. But, just look at it. Doesn't that look like the Grand Canyon, you guys? Four monsters battling at the Grand Canyon. I would love to see that. They're shoving... Okay. They're shoving each other into rocks and stuff. That'd be awesome. Maybe there'd even be civilians running. But... That'd be a little... Okay. Anyway. Getting off topic. So... Yes. And so... How do you... How do I think this movie will play out with these... Just depending on this poster? It appears that Godzilla will team up with Kong. Sometime in Destroy All Monsters to face off against... The evil Titan army. <laughs> to face off against the Titans. And they f battle around the globe. And then the final battle. The epic final battle would take place in the Grand Canyon, it appears. And so, yeah. And. Yes. But there's one thing that kind of throws me off here. Why does Kong have a 2001, two, oh my, 2005 design? Shouldn't he have the Skull Island design? And also, um, how did the Skull Crawler get so huge? <laughs> I mean, I know I have a Death Crawler in my custom Destroy All Monsters that's huge, but still. Well, you know, the skull crawler could be huge, the same reason that Kong's so huge, but still. Skull crawlers are microscopic to the 2021 Kong. But anyway, there's one thing that makes me think that this could be real, and that is the fact someone pointed out to me that there's King of the Monsters concept art in this image. And, you know, only Legendary would have access to this in 2017. So, do you think, guys? Do you think in two years we'll, we'll get to be able to see a giant monster mash between all of these monsters? I don't know. Possible. But anyway, yeah, I just wanted to show, I just wanted to discuss this with you guys, see what you thought. Tell me what you think about this in the comments below. Do you think this, do you think this could happen in the MonsterVerse and Destroy All Monsters? And if you think it could happen, discuss what you would do.